want to take out all the dry skin underneath the cuticle. And please, on the pedicures, you always need to use mask, gloves, and apron. Always. It's so important. Apron, the reason why you use apron is because you need to cover your clothes, okay? So everything on the rubber side, everything rest uh, looks fine. Here as well. How you can use it is you're gonna put on the middle the uh, foot uh, foil and after you can use the sides to wipe it or to dry it or whatever but when you have this one it's more professional and more comfy for you okay because what happened is during you file the feet the food from the dry skin all the dry skin will be here so imagine now wipe it or i don't know dry it with the same towel it's no good okay but definitely you can kind of uh, cover yourself but it's always good to have two small towels always need to grab the scrub and always the wood spatula always please girls don't put the uh, hands or your finger to grab the scrub because it's not hygienic enough mm -hmm. okay and we have the cuticle serum okay which comes with vitamins this is very good we call it vitamin serum vitamin uh, like cuticle uh, remover cuticle cream it's more or less same thing yeah it's just the way how the companies want to sell them okay we have the polishes here we have one dark and one the base definitely girls same thing as we as the hands we will learn the dark color and of course french is very important client love french you will have a clean surface of the nail plate no like hair left over from the cotton no nothing it's so easy and they're so good okay so we have the cuticle pusher okay this cuticle pusher definitely needs to go inside of the barber side okay because you use it on the skin okay never outside i have here something you have used this one and you have left it here once you use it use it through it okay because they are so cheap and they are single use i know sometimes girls on the salon if you will have a look on this it's like all black i don't know the reason why i think it's just because they are not careful and no professional because they are so cheap and you can just use this for one single use for one client you clean it very very well after you use and before you use it because you never know if the person who used this bowl before was very careful and tidy this looks a bit like very bad because it's like a bin bag but mm. if you google and if you go to the supplier you will have special bag clear bag for the pedicure to cover the pedicure bowl yeah after we finish you can all do your research and i'm sure very you will find it there okay so i will just demonstrate it with a bin bag but the way is the same so this is black that will be clear so it's more nicer you just need to put the bowl inside yeah like this and you can just like try to fix it here on the side we add the water inside okay we need to add the soap you can uh, add any salt you can add like uh, fresh petals uh, from roses you can add like dry flowers whatever you want to add to make the pedicure a bit more pampering a bit more special yeah what i do i add like ro fresh roses petals um if you go to little definitely you will find with two pound fifty like 10 roses you can just keep them in one side and you can add just like a few uh, petals you can have the uh let's say the bowl on the two different ways this is like one way this is one way but i think this is easy for you the reason is you have more space to work so first what we do girls is we prepare our tools we have a look on the nail we need cotton definitely girls to remove any polish whatever it is so you need to have the cotton closer okay so this is her natural hands like this so you can't do much so what you're gonna do girls is you're gonna hand sanitize this is for feet yeah first we apply you can even girls add some water on this uh, um, cuticle because it's too thick and it's difficult for you to do it okay so straight away on the water check the water please if it's too hot yeah, it's maybe fun. we maybe we can remove this for now because yeah. we will just put the feet inside so i will just put this closer to my client like this 
is the water fine we don't need to get worried to be worried for it because she is enjoyed it's like relaxing definitely yeah. and we will wait like five minutes for it yeah we can put the timing this always in. okay here i have the tool i put it on my side because i will need the cuticle pusher i will need the cuticle nipper i will need the clipper okay i will need everything now closer to me so i will open the towel and i will just put the towel here half on the belly uh, station half on my lap the reason is i'll put the feet here and i will just it right mm -hmm. this one out hand just here closer to me mm -hmm. just and i will just try gently i know because they are too long right now Her shape, it's quite squarish. So what I'm gonna ask the client, and maybe she will accept it, is like if we can go square and around the edges. Square oval, yes. While I'm doing it, with my middle finger, I will push down her second finger. The reason why is because when I'm filing, I don't wanna hurt her. Look, mm. if I file here, definitely this file will catch the second finger, so with my Middle finger, I will push it down. We need to tidy all this part here. You see this part? We need to tidy. Look, I'm going inside of her nail. You can definitely, girls, if you want, you can add here a limb pad and maybe you can tie everything on top of the limb pad, yeah? The client, even if you're doing any mistake. And roll. So look, when you roll, you take out of the dry skin inside and on the other side I told you there is two ways girls how you can do it one way is you go round all the round or finish one side on the middle on the other side you go and work from the other side this is your choice yeah whatever it's easy for you Look, I'm going here inside of her skin, yeah? First you need to make sure you remove all the skin. Once that this is uh, clean and nice, it's an all around. The reason why we do it is to make the nails a bit more smoothy. All this white part that you see, don't worry, it will come off little by little. Let's go with the buffer. Look now, what's the difference? What difference will be? It's 100% different. So make sure you use all, all the steps. Huh? And we go with the foot file in every single finger. See here? Look with this foot file. But just this side. And we find it. Okay, look how it makes it nice and smooth. Here, it's lots of dry skin here on top. I go and I find it. It is painful? Mm. No at all. Okay. So the way how I'm doing, I'm I don't don't do it like this. Go consistent movement, okay? Because this is the way how the foot file works better. I have a look if I need to to remove any more. But during that time, you will make it smoother, okay? Your posture always straight, your back straight, and start working but side to side, yeah? Not just one side of the heel, side to side. So now we go with the scrubbing. We need to rub it, huh? in circle movements but on the heels we need to rub it more than everywhere else sometimes when you do the scrub you avoid the middle one you know how much dry skin you have here what we do now is we will remove all this scrub from her feet we clean every single part of the nail and now we need to make sure, girls, that the cuticle part, it's good. So we need to do the last checks, okay? So, dry skin. 
close the inside, you try to... And after you can spread it all around. Rub it, yeah, no massage, no like a florage. Or you can buy them, one for single client, but this is the cheapest way. And it's quite good. Okay, we start with the base. First, we make sure we clean everything because there can be some oil. We prepare the nails for the um, polish for the base. So how we do it, girls? We do one base, two color, and one top. top. Very pretty. Closer to the cuticle, you need to go slowly, slowly. If you don't do it slowly, trust me, believe me, it will be so difficult for you. Make sure you cover the edge and on the small one. Very closer to the cuticle goes. Make sure everything is close to the cuticle. Because we don't want the nail to look like it's been there. The polish to look like it's been there for a week. Let's see here. We start from the big one. It's no rule. You can start it wherever you want. So girls. For the girls who have the problem with um, applying the color side to side to the first layer you need to because once you don't apply it it will be very visible I did the skin out okay everything that is out of the nail and after we go and create the smiley line in all of the nails here closer we go on the side and we tidy. Okay. Clean the brush, cover everything, cover the free edge. Everything. It's important, the top coat is important. Once you have applied everywhere, make sure you cover the free edge. Okay, and just one drop of the cuticle oil. Leave it 10 minutes to dry and all down for you. Okay. The cuticle oil definitely need to be rubbed on the cuticle, okay? You rub it very well and all done. This is the pedicure, girls. Yeah, you can remove this one. And all done for her. You have a quick look on, and uh, that's it. So what you need to take care of is, don't worry. Even if you have touched a bit the skin and it looks the skin a bit red, once she wash it, it will be fine. So don't take all your time spending with trying to take off that part, which very easily by washing the feet will come off. Uh, don't spend lots of time on dry skin just work as much as you can okay so if the dry skin doesn't come off means like the client has dry skin a lot and you need to give aftercare home care advice how to deal with it or they need to come every two weeks to do a pedicure yeah or definitely we can upgrade our treatment for more which can be like a mask with thermomintons which will make the dry skin softer and smoother or definitely the paraffin wax which maximally will hydrate the skin will help with the color of the skin circulation of the blood and everything try your best try to figure it out please use the cuticle uh, the foot file on the sides of the nail um, yeah on the toes uh, it will make your job 50% easy because once you do this everything come more cleaner huh? If you just don't use this on top of your toes even after you wash it I mean we applied here oils, but even when we was painting it was no like dry skin coming up If I didn't use this definitely that there would be more like messy and stuff 
so with this it makes your job easy okay thank you so much girls thank you, thank thank you so you. much and uh, yeah let's see now how you would do it